So I've been hearing a lot, um, a lot of the videos about about club life or clubbing is dead, and I'm just giving off my perspective and my experiences with clubs and parties and whatnot. Um, number one, uh, uh, we gotta be very careful about a lot of cases about the um, Spanish, like people taking advantage of and putting uh, Spanish flies in their drinks. And yeah, that's one of the things um, we're very careful, well, very careful on that. Recent, recently, there has been this has been some improvements, thank God. But overall, that's probably one of the reasons why uh, clubbing or partying ain't as fun. Uh, another thing um, that why clubs or parties, in some cases, are not as fun is because the mean mugging. Particularly if you're thinking about, you know wanted to dance with a chick or dance with a dude or whatnot. Me mugging and y'all just look very unapproachable with with that kind of face. <laughs> um yeah, if you're constantly me mugging people or just doing, you know, eye rolling people, that's just rude. But overall, um yeah, that's probably one of the reasons why club culture is dying or dead. Um another reason why why is because of um yeah, the drinks. Yes, drinks. Drinks are hella expensive and whatnot, and it just makes no sense. It doesn't. You have to spend like hundreds of hundreds, yeah, hundreds of, pretty much thousands of dollars for a drink. That's probably just watered down, um, and it's just it's just not. Another reason is that it's not enough space for anybody to move. We're just all huddled up together. I'm feeling somebody's, you know, like step back, you're standing kind of close. I feel a little bit coming through on you. Yeah, that. <laughs> um, yeah, there's just a lot of huddle up together and stuff like that. Um, another reason why club culture is kind of dead is, um, yeah, pretty much people. Um, People are just huddled up with each other, you know, ladies are pretty much dancing with one another or um, in another and dudes are just, you know, they just there just to be there. Yeah, people are not interacting. Um, and uh, as I got to say that since a lot of women have been, you know, telling men to not uh, no longer approach them and whatnot, um, I guess it's kind of difficult for them to spend money. Especially if, you know, they're the main ones probably, you know, giving them drinks, giving women drinks and whatnot. Um, yeah, that's probably one of them. Um, another... What else? What else? What else? What else? What else? Um, yeah, DJs. Oh, yeah, social, me uh, social media. A lot of DJs are pretty much going online. They're going online to play, you know, play their whatever that their music is a lot of mixes and people are pretty much staying home um and since us millennials <laughs> we're old so we're more than likely to stay home <laughs> we're more than likely to stay home or possibly you know when a dj is playing whatever the music online on tiktok and whatnot yeah there's a but there there is a genre of people that's flocking to that they're flocking to the djs uh, from the comfort of their own home through their computers, phones, and whatnot. Um, what else? Oh, social media. Anything else? Um, I feel like. No, I think that's pretty much it. I think that is pretty much it. You feel like I'm missing anything? Please let me know. Uh, oh, also another thing: couples are taking over the club. At least from at least from my experience, um, couples are taking over. Couples are taking over. Couples, married people, sometimes divorce, are literally taking over the club. Because <laughs> uh, I, it, it, I you can't. I don't know. Maybe that's just me. That's just me. But overall, but overall, overall, 